The easiest way to identify positive and negative numbers in Excel is with an if function. So here we've got a bank balance. We want to know is are we in overdraft or do we have a credit balance? So the function we can use is the if function. And the key one here is the logical test. Let's look at that bank balance. And is it bigger than zero? We know that's a positive. In this case, we then know that we get the lower interest rate. So I can then just add that and put my dollar signs on. If it's not bigger than zero, it must be less than zero. So when you use the higher rate. So the if function with this will tell us what the positive is and the opposite would be negative. If we change this around, so if I said that is less than zero, then all we need to do is make sure that our true and falses are correct. When I say OK, I can now copy it down. And it'll correctly notice positive or negative and perform some action based on that.